Let's now take you to the Ashanti region where residents of Dabai and Sokobai within the Kumasi Metropolitan Assembly are threatening to stage a demonstration after enduring months of water shortages caused by damaged pipelines due to ongoing road construction works. Now, despite repeated pleas to the contractor to repair the pipelines, the issue remains unresolved. Residents are now calling on the government to urgently intervene. Channel One News' Ashanti Regional Correspondent Fati Aminu Ibrahim reports. For almost five months, residents of Dabain, Sokobain and nearby communities have suffered from a water shortage due to damage to their pipelines during road construction. Both domestic and commercial users have been severely affected. Mamia Joa, a hairdresser, mentions that having to carry water on her head several times a day has taken a toll on her health. Se ensue ni wa Ghana ma ye bre nti ama e ma e wo ntamu ha e bre papa papa sabi o mo ma wo fofro o mo ma wo fofro o mbe sora ho ma chi be kwa ko to abura wo temase e na be bia ye ko pension no so ne se me de ade ne ko fo a ma bre me san ko fo a ko fio me ma ho den ye se ma ho den ye se san de ne kra me ko hospital she explains that other hairdressers and businesses in the area are facing similar struggles. Yes, Romo. Ebiya, ohu se ya menkwa na menam sa problem mu. Enya menkwa. Ya brepa hairdresser for bre. Hairdresser for o sokor ban brepa. Empo kra o hwe kwan na. Enya sokor ban kwa na nsuo ni mao. Cro from Ampeyo, Ampa me konyina. Nsuo ni mao. Because omu twa Hajara Mohammed, a resident of Sokobain, shares how this ongoing water shortage has impacted her daily life. The assembly member for the area expressed frustration, stating that multiple attempts to have the issue resolved have been unsuccessful. The <laughs> And the dear to our to our Sukrona to Ampame, Abu Abu Munano, the near assembly members near Yina Yasia, or the Bia Druno, I told says Yina Yakabum. He calls on the government to intervene and ensure that the pipelines are repaired immediately, warning that residents will be forced to demonstrate if no action is taken. And the best say is Cassam and I ever could do be here for a buying one one far. Nins, you know, Emma, when you ask them to ya, or Ghana water for a cardia, I best say, I buy M1 won't you ask, and I am my was so called by. And yes, so called by, I could free up with it. Yeah, you hear the enjoyings you. At the end, you know, so dear, a bema man for a so called bufua, a woman, a becosro. Because that was the same. Yamea Doma, Yeshia Bra, Mimi, there we are betting up as a Monday. Community need the pressure is here so for demonstration. Meanwhile, Authorities at the Ghana Water Company Limited in an earlier interview with Channel One News denied claims that they had received payments from the contractor to fix the damaged pipelines. Several efforts by Channel One News to get a response from the contractors working on the road projects have been unsuccessful. Now the residents say they've exhausted all avenues in their attempts to get the situation fixed, but unfortunately for them, it remains the same. They are thus left with no option but to embark on a demonstration to impress upon authorities to do their needful. For Channel 1 News, I am Fatih Amin Ibrahim, Dabain Sokobain, Ashanti Region.